Alrighty. So we have another Katago versus Katago game. Uh, again, this is very high playouts. Uh, this one's a little interesting. Normally it would be this one, simply because you don't want to let your opponent approach from the side they have support on, but not a huge deal. Okay, this is a pretty common. Stopping the Shamari is quite big. And then this one is also known as an urgent move. Okay. And we get the classic two space high. So the next move I expect to be the urgent move. Yep. Okay, so now we're pushing and it's a Moyo versus Moyo game. And this is a, an interesting little setup here. Okay. And that's pretty much the last move for the opening. So now we should expect middle game shenanigans. So if I'm black, it's got to be the top or the bottom. That's a tough choice. Maybe a Hane right here. Okay, so black chose the bottom. And we're just building up our framework. And white is doing the classic reduce wall building. And so white is uh, getting their moyo while also pushing and limiting black's moyo. Um, black will have to go up top at some point. Black's getting a lot of solid cash though. Like down here is pretty much solid cash almost. So influence is very big and so I'm not saying white's down by any means, but like, that's a lot of cash. Okay, we've got to go up top. <laughs> there we go. Uh, classic approach. I would have expected something here, but maybe white doesn't care about these three as much as the Mayo. Okay. Another option to consider is kick and then two space high. This is a common variation as well. Mm-hmm. Get some MySpace. Uh okay, that's weird. Um so invading AI is really good at invading, so I'm not gonna comment too much about this. This requires a lot of reading and blah blah blah. But the timing is very odd. I would expect this, but like I guess as soon as Black's alive and from here we could read that Black's gonna live at uh some point then now maybe it's because if we don't take Black's territory and Black took our territory, then we're going to be behind. So I guess that's the timing. It's just lots of reading. All right. So we're just going for life. And Black's just choosing a simple surround sequence. Um, I'm not sure about this cut. There should be pretty easy life in the corner. Um, with something. Uh, hard to say. Maybe here. Just reduce, reduce. That should be alive. So what are we? What are we trying to do here? Uh, this is the shape point because bamboo. Okay, so we're going for a squeeze more than life. Interesting. But we haven't gained anything yet, so I'm not quite seeing white's plan yet. Like, I understand what the white moves do, but I don't quite see the future that white's seeing yet. Okay, it looks like we're going to be breaking into here. So instead of the cash right here, we're getting the cash over here. That, that's fair. Ooh. If something's here, that's big. Mm-hmm. Ooh, there's lots of reading here. Okay. 
Okay, um, so the simple answer is here or here to fix your cutting points, right? We're going here, and that can say, hey, I don't care about the two stones because I can make life here or maybe squeeze this somehow. <laughs> Um, or maybe like peep something. Oh, there's so much to read. Okay, that's not, I have no idea how to explain that. <laughs> there's so much reading involved. Um, there's lots of Maji though. Okay, so the ladder doesn't work, so we're just doing that, yeah. Okay, so basically we sacrificed this. Um, or basically made it a Mii. I'm either going to destroy the points here or I'm going to break into here. So that's kind of what the Mii was. And why it's, the AI is just really good at um, reading. So uh, it's quite difficult to follow. We're still not alive. There's no way we win this capture race. Um, what? <laughs> I have no idea what's going on. Okay, um, so let's just play this out. Dude, 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 dude. Connect. Okay, so black can die. And if black played here, there's at least a co. Black plays here, here, starts taking the liberties. This should be I versus no I. Maybe it's not. Um, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what to tell you. I think Black is dead. That's the conclusion that I'm coming to. But Black has all these codes and stuff. So I guess Black's just saving it for later. Uh, but then we also have to ask if these stones are alive, are these stones alive? <laughs> I mean, there's plenty of Aji, but like, oh, there's so much reading. There's some conclusion that I'm just not seeing yet, but there's definitely a conclusion here. I just don't know what it is, <laughs> uh, but white can't be dead. White cannot be dead everywhere with no consequence. Like these cannot all be dead with no consequence. That would be like horrible. So there's definitely some sequences. Okay, so white, white is just fixing it immediately. White's not even going to worry about a cow. There's still a cow. Um, excuse me. Mm -hmm. Okay, so the points are pretty close. <laughs> the points are pretty close because we can uh, draw a circle here and here, actually. Uh, and then we can get that. So this is solid territory, and then probably this is going to die, but there's still a go. There's still a go right there. So probably it's... Oh, I can't even count this because the stupid go. Black has more cash because this is undecided. But white should have more cash if this was dead. But because the co, then it's hard to say. Yeah, this is the next big thing to do if the bottom's irrelevant. There's still this annoying co. Is this not anything to worry about? I don't know. Guess save it for later. Eh, this is just some annoying sabaki. Hmm, 
I believe this is looking at some Aji. Um, at this cut. Okay, so now white's getting surrounded, but we all know the AI can live pretty nicely. Hmm, I like this. I like this. Yeah, the corner is big in points, but if you die, then... Yeah, surrounding things are important. We can always come back to live. Oh, the AI is like the master of me, I, I swear. The AI is just the master of me, I. All right, so the idea of these tiger's mouth is to fix the wedges. Like there's no wedge, right? So that's the idea here. Okay, so traded the corner for this. And now we're gonna squeeze it and make life. There's that cow. <laughs> There's the cow. All right, um, I guess it's finally big enough. Black needs a lot of moves in a row though to win this cow. And that should kill black. Yeah. So it's not a cow anymore because I can go here and you can't live in the corner and you'll lose the capture race. And there's no life in the corner. So yeah, I, I believe it's just done now. Okay, but black cut these off in the exchange. Um... Black's not also also uh, not 100% alive. So complicated. Okay, so Sabaki again. Fancy is fancy. Okay. We're still dead. Got a fix. Or no, you, okay, 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 okay. So if I cut and this to Suji exist. Got it. I am understanding now. Okay, so this is looking for some points to make up for the dead group. That is threatening the group. Timing is weird, but whatever. This is just points. And now we're back to the group. <laughs> so it's going between endgame and the group here. I'm pretty sure white's dead. And if white is dead, then white has to have enough territory to make up for it. So let's see, we're at move 172. One seventy two black is up by one point zero point nine. Yeah, totally. Can totally count this. Uh, um the end game does look in white's favor because this section black can't really make anything, but white can. There's lots of forcing moves for white. So I think the end game's in white's favor, so I can kind of feel similar. Yep, there's the points. Yeah, AI is a master of endgame. If Dawn players can gain like 20 points to 30 points against Q players in endgame, the AI can probably gain like 30 to 50 points to Dawn players. <laughs> it's ridiculous. Well, that's fancy. Uh, that's threatening to kill. That's important. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. 
okay so for those who are, i'm just watching the life and death because you can take the eye here but then there's an atari and an eye right there right so we're just watching that and now we're threatening the throw in co uh or not even a go not even a go um because yeah not even a go just squeezing it for all it's worth and then responding to this decision. Yeah, so all, all it is is the AI is like, can't decide if endgame or Sente. Like Sente moves that I'm gonna get no matter what or do I keep playing endgame? And that's, that's the idea. Yep. I'm surprised about this one instead of this one. Oh, but, well, I guess you're going to lose it later anyway. Okay, so it doesn't matter if you, because if Black plays here, then you have to respawn, otherwise you die. So that is three points, and that is three points. Okay, cool. Yeah, it's just better at vital points. Don't mind me. Um, it's pretty big. This was this was nothing. This is just AI being AIs. AI is being AI. Okay, so black is losing because the AI the black AI is freaking out and can't figure out what to do to win. So it's guessing now at Sente moves. That is usually what happens when AI just freaks out. No way. Really? Really? <laughs> what are we doing? Like time decisions for AI? What? <laughs> like, what are all these moves? We're just losing go threats for no good reason. Um. I don't know. Time to see use for AI. Oh, that's crazy. Oh, black. Black's freaking out. Black's freaking out. <laughs> uh, well, I guess it's. I guess black doesn't know what to do, right? He's trying to live. Wow. Okay, where is this? Da, da, da. Okay, so it's because the AI started glitching. That's what happened here. So why, it's, why, it's only, why was it only up by like one, right? But for the AI, like what one percentage is that? Uh, 69%. So that's almost decided. <coughs> well, why I say that, but Black was at 69% earlier. Wow, what a reversal. Um... But I guess less moves, so it doesn't know how to come up with something. It doesn't. It's not. It's not able to like figure out the right sentai moves to apply. So it starts guessing at the sentai moves, which ones do it. And yeah. Now we get into seventy-two, and we're just being stupid. So I'm not surprised after a certain point the, that things just drastically get worse because the AI doesn't care about the score. Whether it's 25 points or whether it's um, one point, right? All it cares about is the one percentage. So for us, it's like, oh, wow, that drastically changed. But the AI is like, no, it really didn't. It was the same. White was going to win regardless. I just guessed at things to try to change the percentage. So it just doesn't care. Right? The AI doesn't care about points at all. It only cares about one percentage. So we can see that the AI, uh, the black AI got a bit stupid uh, at the end. Um, but we can also see that the white AI is a master of me. I, um, I don't, the life and death up here is interesting. That would be a very interesting go plot problem exercise.
negative 21. Okay, so here it would be like the percentage thing, right? Because if it's negative 21, but here, um, percentage. Yeah, just white's going to win no matter what, so it doesn't matter. Um, but this is a this is a go problem. So what if I give this up? Two, three. Yeah, make the eye. Boom, boom. And is this eye versus no eye? It should be eye versus no eye. So it's, this isn't a secchi. This is I versus no I. So black's alive, but I lost a big chunk. White's up by 13. What did I do wrong? I don't know. Okay, so black can live, but if I go right here, then the whole group dies. No, it's a Seki. But white's up at 23. What? <laughs> what? Giving up the stones and keeping white dead is worth like 10 points, almost 10 points. Oh, counting is hard. Like I said, very interesting go problem. Very interesting go problem here. But the win percentage doesn't change, so it doesn't really matter for the AI. Yeah, this whole bottom side. Master of me. It's like, okay, you destroyed my stuff, but I got points. So I'm gonna start over here, then sack it to get over here, and sack it to get over here, then sack it to get all this. As long as I get something, I don't care because you destroyed that. As long as I get one of the four cookies, it'll make up for your cookie. Okay, that's all I care about. I don't care which cookie I get. You take this cookie, I'll take this cookie, blah, blah, blah. All right, that's what, and the, so the A is like really, really flexible. And that's why I can live in like the smallest areas because it's like, it doesn't care about trades. Uh, as long as it gets something. Um, yeah. Interesting guy. All right. Well, this one was a lot shorter than the last one, but I think it's because I couldn't keep up with the reading. The reading of this one was so much more complex. So uh, I was kind of guessing. Yeah, I couldn't keep up with the reading uh, on the bottom side. The bottom side was crazy. Lots of variations on the bottom, I'm sure. Right, uh, hopefully you uh, enjoyed the review.